Can I have uh, two double sausage and egg McMuffin meals, please? Hello there, welcome to uh, Back of the Landing Net. Um, well, it's minus four, it's freezing, it's December. Um, where better to come and catch a winter cup than uh, Wadmill down at Top of Manor? Yeah, first choice in it for if, you, if the uh, conditions are desperate. It's worth getting down here. And today we've uh, we got down two of the guys who deserve better camera time after filming most of the matches being on Little Hayes, but Gareth and Damien and um, <laughs> Rich. There's your mate Rich, so he's come along for a fish. So oh, I tried to get. No, him. it's uh, someone extra to hopefully catch a fish, mate. We, we appreciate everyone. That's it. We'll take anything we can get today, to be honest. So, yeah, I mean, we're down here with Wadmill, a few of us, so we might as well watch you do a little match for Biggest Fish. Yeah, have a little bit of fun. Let's have yeah. it up. Let's see Sounds what happens. Good. Yeah, so, but um, you lads have been here since yesterday. Oh, there oh, goes. Jay Goat. Uh, oh, Jay again. Okay. Very busy yeah. today. What paint was that on, mate? Two little uh, mini pots. Just going into the weed, mate. It's going to be a bit of a. Oh, no. Hey, what well up, mate? Cheers, dude. Right, that. It's a good start. Right, there we go. Uh, probably had the rods in about half an hour. Had a couple of tickles um, before this one went off. Um, just landed another one now. Um, my rod screened off. Uh, cracking little start on this December freezing cold morning. That is a lovely one as well. So Even. let's get onto that. Beautiful Back pitch. of the landing there. You got another one coming, mate. Beautiful, beautiful. Right, unbelievable. Um, just while I was uh, chatting to you about that other one, uh, my other rod goes. Chris hits it. Damien brings it in. Um, <laughs> oh no! Oh yeah. <laughs> no, Jay, he wasn't at the match. No. Nah. Um, and uh, Rich nets it there and uh, got a lovely comment. So, plate and mirror, lovely comment in the space of about five minutes. Minus four degrees in December. Lovely. Back of the landing net. Back of the landing net. Come on, boys, let's get some more, eh? Right, so I just thought I'd uh, quickly run through what I'm using. I've uh, just had a couple of fish quite quickly, so um, pretty common winter tactics. Um, it's freezing today, but the sun's shining, water's quite clear, a lot of visibility for the fish. Um, so I've got one on a bright pink tuna tang uh, mistral pop-up. Um, second one I've got on uh, two 10mm mini pops, one orange, one pink. Again, good visibility, um, and I've got that sat on top of um, four powdered coconut ice boilies so I've ground them right down to powder just think that's a great area of visibility um, with the uh, two fluorescent mini pops being a good vocal point so um, really going minimal and uh, it's paid off so far so that's one job we don't mind doing all right, Gareth, you've been here for a little while now. No luck? No, no luck as of yet. Um, considering having a little move next door when it's a bit more open water, uh, I think it's a bit too shallow by the islands. Don't seem to be wanting to take part. Could be. I mean, we're quite lucky today. The lake's pretty quiet, as you'd expect, so we can actually cast to the other side as long as obviously the swims are free. And it's, and that's, the, that's where Jay's picked up t his two fish on the other side. Oh, looks, like Jay's, oh, looks like Jay's in the number three. What bait was that on, mate? On the tuna tank, uh, I think it's your pop up again. This time, uh, put some of the rose spray on it. Oh, combination of flavours. This is a sort of take a stroll. <laughs> <laughs> mate, lovely stuff. Um, absolutely freezing, ice cold fish here, but. Very, very welcome um, on this cold December morning. 
Um, seems like I'm on the fish at the moment. I feel a bit like the lucky one. Uh, but I think we'll all get something. Well, I hope we will. But really loving this. It's brilliant. Back of the landing net. Hello guys, a um, couple of hours in, How, how's it going? How's it getting any knocks? Uh, it's been pretty hard, we've had a couple of knocks. Um, I had one run this morning, but yeah. uh, I couldn't get out of bed quick enough to get it. Uh, <laughs> oh yeah, so you've been, there, you've been in the night actually, haven't you? Yeah? yeah, we have, yeah, it was a cold one. It was uh, down to about minus four, minus five last night. But, uh, we were, yeah, we were all right, weren't we? So, uh, but yeah, nothing to write home about, unfortunately. It's, uh, it's been a pretty hard session, really. So a couple of missed last night, a couple of missed this morning. Yeah. Um, and I had a run earlier on after you edged for the first one, I think it was. Yeah. Uh, but no, I haven't had anything in you. Seems a little bit more lively, and Chris has just had a knock as well now. Carpet and cooking, episode three. Nice. Yeah. Uh, what, what are you knocking up? Sausage. Anything? Just, any, just sausages? Just sausages. Not even any oil in the pan. Well, you wouldn't, they got fat in, didn't they? So yeah, you just cook it. Another little tip. Yeah? Yeah, don't need to buy that. And uh, yeah, we're just making sausages, make some hot dogs. Well, it's perfect, isn't it, for winter conditions, isn't it? Oh, well, what more could you need? Very complex. Take the sausages out of the packet and put them in the pan. Nice. Let them twist them around a bit. Then they're done. Oh. Hold on, mate. So, do the costings for us. The costings? 12 sausages. They're not the best sausages, but they're, you know, reputable, reputable mate. So, uh, but 175 for 12. Yep, yep. Bread roll 70p for six. Nice. Yeah, so I'm thinking three rounds of double hot dogs throughout the day. How much? 220? 220. Yeah, that would, couldn't even get a sandwich for that, so nice. Yeah, and it's hot as well. Beautiful, perfect. Brown sauce costs a quid, but it's got to be done. You're going to be the next Jamie Oliver, mate. <laughs> do you reckon? Yeah. Is it? So just remember, I mean, we'll do a recipe on our website, but it's sausages. Yeah, he's got more hair in his baby. Are you scared of it? Why are you getting stuck in the stuff? <laughs> <laughs> oh, here he is, what a surprise, Jay's into another one. He loves it, he loves it down here. Well, so it feels a bit bigger. They just all scrap so well though, don't they? It's hard to sort of... Let's hope so though. He's in there. Well, I can't believe it. Four. Um, just got after lunchtime now, and um, to be honest, I wish they'd start spreading themselves out a bit now. These guys yeah. want to catch a fish, um, but I'm quite happy to take them. Uh, another one on the chod, um, pink chod down here, tuna tang with rose hip glug, um, really seems to be doing the business. So, uh, chuffed with that. Won't believe how cold this thing is. Unbelievable. Back of the landing net. Oh dear, so yeah, it's, it's going alright for me, four carp so far, but um, I don't know, Chris, Chris hasn't really seemed on it today, it's, it's like his mind's been on something else, so um, you know, I don't know, I don't know what, he, what, he's, what he's thinking about, what he's doing, but, uh, you know, uh, oh dear. Oh. You alright mate, you're, you're taking a bit of time with the paper today. 36 mate, 36. 36 what? 36 tits, 5 bums and 
two camel toes. <laughs> That's it. How's it been going? Had any fish? Oh dear. Yeah, it's not just Chris that's uh, not really focusing on the carp fishing. I haven't seen the other three guys doing too much today either. Yeah, 36 tits. Five bumps. Can only see one camel toe. Anyway, Jay's into another fish. How's he feel? Alright, but I don't, I don't think he's massive, but... They can trick you sometimes though, can't they? Yeah. I landed a fifth fish, and Chris could stick a rod in there just to see if it's the area rather than... <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh. Oh, he's in there. Lovely. Oh, that could be a bit bigger. Well, so I'm just having a quick look in his mouth because we think he's one of the new stuff, new fish in here. Absolutely perfect. It's gorgeous, yeah. Right, let's get him up and have a look at the rest of them. Yeah. Well, there we go. Uh, fish number five for me. I'm having a very lucky day. Very, very lucky day for December. And, um, you know, probably just under a double, I'd say, but absolutely mint condition common. I mean, you'd be happy catching these all day. It's lovely. Uh, I just want, want some of these guys to catch something, but I'm not complaining. Back of the land in it. Right, this is the news we've been waiting for. Um, Chris is finally into a fish. How's it feel, Chris? How's it feel? Yeah, I've seen him. Maybe just under a double. Right, well here he is, caught on the trolley again, inspired by Jay. What is he? Just about eight pounds, wasn't he? Yeah, stunning. Something like that. But anyway, lovely scales, cracking fish, absolutely freezing, but back of the land in there. Thank God for that. <laughs> nice one, mate. Well done. Right, well, the very last knock-ins, literally just packing away all the stuff. Ending's been done. Damien Rod pulled off a screamer. Nice. How's it feel? Um, it doesn't feel too big. What do you remember that? Oh, he's going for it, isn't he? <laughs> hey, nice one. Hello, mate. Ben. Nice one, mate. Last knock-ins. Yeah, last knock-ins. Uh, just all packing up, ready to go home now. It's been here for the full weekend. It's been a long time coming, but uh, finally got one in the bag. Caught on a rose hip pop-ups. So, just on the trolley rig again. It seemed to be working today. Excellent. Back of the landing net. Nice one. Right, that's it today for back of the landing net. Um, yeah, it's been been an eventful day, really. Um, carp seem to have been around my swim, um, which I don't mind. It'd be nice if everyone got something. Wow, only in certain areas. <laughs> that's it. Yeah, definitely seemed to be your little spot paying off. You had five, I had one. Unfortunately, you lads didn't catch, but. You know, tried everything. It's, it's December at the end of the day. And I think you're just doing the right thing on the right spot, and that was what produced the fish. Yeah, that's it. That's it. A bit of a result. Good news is, though, um, you know, we're having our um, spring ma spring matches down here next year. Uh, obviously, we didn't the announce the dates um, the other week. Uh, looks good. Yeah, the 18th and 19th of May. Um, it's a two-day match where you basically fish one day, you get weighed up. And um, in the evening, we're going to have a little bit of a social, but you can go home, you can carry on fishing if you want. Um, then the next day, we'll do a redraw. You fish from a different peg, or you know, maybe even the same peg, and see two combined weights over the two days. And that'll be the champion, really. Nice. But anyway, we'll keep you informed of uh, when tickets are available, etc. Well, I have six carp are coming out, minus four in December on it. It's going to be pretty prolific, I think, by spring. Definitely. Well, they've just had the 98 new double put in here. Unfortunately, they're, they're keeping their heads down today. I think it's just too cold. That's it. That's it. Well, you know, mate. Overall, 
can't really grumble. Um, you know, I've had six cup, 36 titties, five bumps. Can't see can't And it all given. <laughs> I'm getting bloody fed up with these ass givens, mate, to be perfectly honest. Next episode, mate. We're yeah. going to sort them out. Yeah, well, the thing is, they seem to just be targeting us. I haven't heard any reports of ass givens from anywhere, have you? The last one was at our match. Yeah, I know. I thought I'd, you, I thought something would come, I thought I'd see it in the paper or something, but no. No, absolutely nothing. So, um, yeah, we're going to... They're, obviously, they're following us, mate. You know what I mean? Yeah. Next time we'll be out. I can't see us being out before Christmas. Can you? Can you? Nah. It's gonna have to be Christmas, mate. And if they try and run, right, yeah, we're gonna be prepared, mate. We're gonna get them. Christmas, get ready. I'm gonna smash their faces in. I've got a lot of them, I remember that. Oh, I know, they've got a nick. <laughs> yeah, they've got a nick, they're fishing over.